What is going on guys and girls? My name is James Orbexy and welcome back today to a brand new game on the channel. Today we are going to be checking out Bermuda Lost Survival. So just before we get started, a little bit of backstory. Basically, I've been looking for a game to fill that raft shaped hole in my heart. <laughs> we played a game called Raft recently on the channel and it was super super fun uh, and people seem to really enjoy it. But unfortunately because that game is like pre-alpha, there is only a certain amount of stuff that you can do. Well, the good news is, is I found this one called Bermuda Lost Survival, and uh, it seems to be compared to Raft, to Stranded Deep, a little bit of Subnautica in there as well. And although this game is also in early access on Steam, it looks really cool. So I thought, hey, let's just check it out. Let's give it a go and let's see what's cracking. So it is time for a brand new game. And here we go, here we go. Ooh, <laughs> wow, look at this. So in Raft, because I think that's the game that this is going to be compared to the most, especially in early access. We're on a raft. However, on this one, we're on a little SOS lifeboat dingy thingamajiggy. So, oh my goodness me. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see if we can learn what's going on here. Oh, oh wow. Okay, so in case you are unfamiliar with the Bermuda Triangle, basically it's like this triangle bit of the ocean. Um, and, well, not the ocean, an ocean. <laughs> but um, it's kind of like sort of near the Caribbean Sea. It's sort of Florida... Bermuda and uh, Puerto Rico, I think, sort of around there. Uh, but basically, this is an area where, like, loads of boats sink mysteriously and planes crash into the ocean and no one knows why. It's kind of like one of those mysterious things in the world. And this game is all about it. So from this map, it seems like we can actually move around this triangle to kind of search for stuff. Wow. Okay, cool. So what have we got here? We've got some med kits. I think F is interact. Okay, there we go. So I can pick up the first aid kits. I can only pick up one. Oh, no, no, I can pick up two. Okay, we've got some, what are these, flares? Can I pick those up? Can I, can I pick the flares up? Why can't I pick the Oh, I don't think I can pick those up. Okay, so we've got a load of food. Right, supplies. What's this? Ooh, this is my crafting box. Okay. So as you can see, already it looks a little bit like Raft in the stuff that we can make here. So it says in very, very tiny letters in the bottom right-hand corner what all of these things are. So this is a wooden platform, uh, wooden walls, wooden door frames. So we, there is like a scavenging element, rope ceilings, drying racks, wooden frames, catwalks, workbench. So we need planks, sticks, metal scraps. Okay, I'm definitely getting some kind of... Uh, Definitely getting some kind of um, of vibes of, of uh, raft here. All right, and we've also got a sleeping bag as well. Okay, so I think the cool thing about this game is that we actually go in the water. Look at this. So do you remember I said this was a little bit like Stranded Deep? Uh, not Stranded Deep, uh, Subnautica. This is why it reminds me of Subnautica. Um, so we need to start like foraging for stuff, I guess. So we need loads of wood. Oh, look at this. There's a boat down here. No way. Okay, so the one thing I'm worried about is that there's going to be things that will attack us. Um, but I guess we can just grab as many sticks and wooden planks and stuff as we possibly can. We have our um, health bar on the right-hand side there. So the good news is we've got plenty of oxygen, for now anyway. And we need to use the ocean floor to actually scavenge for all of our things. So I'm guessing that if we can build some kind of boat, we can actually start traveling in and around the area uh, to kind of get better quality things. But for now, anyway, let's just pick up a load of wood and sticks. I don't know if I can, like, if there's a limit to how much I can carry. I hope not. That looks cool in there. Oh, there's a shark! No! Okay, okay, okay. Can I, can I swim fast? I didn't realize there was a shark. Okay, that's slightly concerning. Um, I only have a little knife. <laughs> that's all I've got. Uh, okay, there's my raft, which is good. All right, all right, all right. So I'm wondering... This shipwreck looks kind of tasty, doesn't it? And oh god, get some air, get some air, get some air. I wonder if we can go and scavenge the um, the shipwreck for some kind of better resource. I think that would be good. We also, I think actually the basics, we should probably try and get some water to, uh, together. Let's climb back on this raft. All right, so if we can use our bench, is there anything that we can make with just this random wood? I don't think so. So we've got sticks and we've got planks. Right, okay. Also, if we go into... There's another button here somewhere, I swear. Which button was it? Which button was it? <laughs> Just clicking all the buttons and seeing what happens. <laughs> I thought there was like a, uh, a crafting menu or something. Uh, not a crafting menu. Oh, there we go, there we go. No, 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 that's the inventory box. Huh. 
Maybe I did it wrong. I don't know. Okay, I, I, I don't know what I'm doing. I'll be honest with you. So we need planks and sticks to make uh, platforms. So we're actually going to need quite a lot of things to scavenge. So I tell you what. Are we feeling brave? Yeah, let's go back down. Just want to try and avoid that shark. There's the shark. Is he going to leave me alone? I actually don't know. Um... I mean, it's really cruel to put a shark right next to where I want to go. <laughs> but if we go deep enough, then maybe he will leave us alone. I'm not too sure. I want to go and check inside the boat, see if there's anything here. Wow, it's dark. Okay, I can't see a thing in that boat. So I'm guessing maybe we could have some kind of, like, underwater flares or something. Oh, we can actually harvest the boat? Wait, is that harvesting? Oh, look at that. So if I hit the, um, if I hit the wood, it harvests a ton of sticks. Which seems to be pretty useful. So, can I harvest, like, rock? No, I think I need, like, a special tool for that. We do actually have, um... There's, like, a hammer thing on my, my toolbar there. I don't know what that does right now. But we need more planks of wood, don't we? Can I just take the planks of wood straight, or... No, I think I need to hit them. So, if I hit them, I get a ton of sticks. But I don't really need sticks right now, do I? I need planks. So, I need, I need things like this. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Oh my goodness, this is crazy. So what's this? Seaweed. Oh, can I eat seaweed? Maybe I can. Oh my goodness, okay. I better go and get some air. Oh, go, 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 go. Oh, ooh, I found a chest. I found a chest of some sort. Can I open this? Can I? Oh, I can only harvest it. Are you kidding me? Oh, it's a treasure chest, lads. Are you kidding? How many sticks can a man take? That's the question. So I'm just grabbing a load of planks. Um... We've got eight planks, we've got nine planks, we've got ten planks. I feel like planks are probably the most useful thing that we can have right now. Uh, as if we can't open that, though. Are you serious? Oh, no. Okay, one more thing before we go up. Oh, I'm gutted. I thought we I thought we could get, like, oh, we just get a load of sticks. We could just get a ton of sticks from them. See, those, like, treasure chest things have dropped from the bottom of that boat. But I don't think at this moment we can open them or anything. Oh, wouldn't it be cool if there was something cool in there? Like some precious... Some precious booty or I don't know. I don't know. Maybe 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 a boat. <laughs> a boat inside the chest. That would have been pretty cool. Alright. So what have we got here? What can we actually make? Uh we need twelve planks though. We've only got ten. Wooden platforms, wooden walls, wooden door frames. Yeah, these all require planks. Uh a basic wooden building structure, wooden ceiling, wooden catwalk. So I guess that the best thing to do is are we all also a workbench? Sticks and metal scraps. I mean, we've got loads of space in our inventory. So I guess we just need to get as many planks as possible to get us started. It kind of feels that way anyway. Uh, okay. I mean, I'm kind of curious how to... Um, how to uh, get that hammer. I wonder if that hammer does anything. Hang on, let me see if I can learn the buttons. That might be useful. Oh! Oh! There we go! Look! I've got a hammer! That's really weird. It's it's number four and number six on the keypad. That's so weird. Why is it like that? I, I guess I could change that. Uh, but, okay, so the hammer does something. Deconstruct. Oh! So you know those chests that we found? I wonder if we can deconstruct them into planks. Maybe. I don't know. May Whoa, there's a big shark. <laughs> I don't want to get bitten on my first day. All right, let me, let me see if we can do this. Harvest. Oh, I can't do it. Oh, do oh no. Really? Okay, so it seems I put the items from my inventory into the crafting box, and then that now allows me to make the items that I need. So, um, I guess wooden platforms would be the only thing that we need to really make. Uh, so there we go. I guess we have to start with the platform. How big are the platforms, though? So if we put those in our, in our inventory... Uh, oh, do, wait. How do we use? So those are quick access? How do we use items from our inventory? Because this is... We've only got two... Oh, there we go. Hang on, shift and scroll. Okay. Ah, look at that. Yes. So we can actually... Start making ourselves a big old raft here? Boom. Boom. <laughs> yeah! So I guess the hammer is like our building tool. Um, we're going to need an awful lot more planks though, because that takes 12 each time. 
And the only thing I'm slightly concerned about now is how do we get water? Is this water? I guess that's what I'm slightly concerned about. So how do we... So for example, if we go into here... Supplies. Provides emergency food and drinking water. Okay, use. Ah, and it gives me metal scraps. So when I break the cans open, it gives me metal scraps. And it also fills up my food and water before we have a chance to actually do anything. So I'm guessing maybe we could, like, cook seaweed and stuff. When we actually get started. But I guess the workbench is going to... Yeah, it gives us additional structures and stations. So we need to create a platform that's big enough to then actually have a workstation. And we also need 10 metal scraps. Okay, so the plan of action here is try and find as many planks as possible. Uh, bring them to the surface and then I guess try and make a, uh, a little crafting table. I think that's the best thing that we can do right now. Ooh, look at these big metal tins. Harvest, harvest. How do I harvest the tin? I have no idea how to harvest the tin. Can I do that? Maybe I need another... How do I do that? Can I harvest it with the... I can't do it with the knife. Okay, so well, there's our scrap metal supply. But I guess we need another tool in order to actually get the, the scrap metal. Because we can't... We can't harvest it. No! No! Deconstruct, man! I, I, I don't think the hammer works like that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, okay, so we need um, we need more tools, I guess. Maybe some kind of axe or something in order to do that. Hmm. Hmm. I mean, this is just going to give us sticks. We need planks, man. We need serious planks. Oh, look at this. Oh, yeah, there it is. So it actually said it on my screen. Look, it says tab, and you click, and you open this. Look at this. So this is, we can we can go with tools here. Oh, look. Unlock the axe. Yes. Requires five stone and five sticks. We've got five stone and five sticks, don't we? Oh, okay. So tell you what we'll do. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Uh, we'll get our stone in here. We'll get our sticks in here. So they're in our inventory. And then if we click on tab, we can unlock. Yes. So these are our alternate tools. Unlock the bottle. Can we do that? We need rope in order to do that. So we need... I don't know how to get seaweed maybe if we craft some seaweed. I, I, I don't know if we've got the recipe for that. Um, hammer? So we, can we upgrade our stuff? Oh my goodness, look at this. And our ability. So abilities are coming soon. They're still work in progress. But at least we know now that we've got these different tools. So I reckon that axe might be able to harvest planks from those boxes. Ooh. Okay, that's cool. Alright, it's night time now. So can we sleep? How do we do this? I want to rest until it's daytime again. So rest for 10 hours. Okay. So at least we can go to sleep at night. Maybe certain things come out at night. But I was thinking, well, it's probably best to just do it in the daytime now. So we're going to save ourselves as well. At least we can save, which is good. And there we go. All right. Well, that's awesome. So at least we know kind of what we're doing now, <laughs> which is good. Um, so let's use another one of these. Uh, so i tell you what we'll do. Now that we have this axe... Let's go back to those crates and see if we can harvest a load of planks. Because if we can do that, then we can start actually building a bigger raft area, which we can then actually start to make the crafting bench, which will allow us to do way more things. Oh man, this is a really cool game. I think it's more advanced than raft. I think there's a lot more we can do in it, even though it is our... Yes! Oh, it gives us scrap metal and planks! Yeah! We did a thing, lads! Woohoo! <laughs> Obviously, there's no tutorial, so it's a case of kind of learning as you go along. But that's amazing. And I'm guessing those big metal barrels might also give us scrap metal. Oh, okay, progress has been made. So I'm happy with our progress. For episode one, anyway, I'm pretty happy with the progress. Let's go over to these barrels uh, and let's see if we can harvest these. Yes! Scrap metal! Nice! Okay, that's really good news. I don't know how much I should take. Should I just harvest all of them? I guess we should just harvest all of them. I should probably make a spear as well because there's more than one shark here now, which I have just noticed. Uh, so, okay. Oh, one, one more thing I want to try whilst I've still got a little bit of air is where was that shipwreck? Because I'm guessing maybe we can harvest the wood. For Actually, you know what? Let's go and get some air. <laughs> we'll come back down. Yep, as expected. Now that we've got the hammer, we can actually harvest the shipwreck for a ton of planks. 
Oh, that makes so much more sense. I was so worried. I was like, oh my goodness, we're going to have to scavenge every single one of these planks from the ships, uh, from the floor of the, the ocean? That's going to be impossible. But no, the good news is, is that we can get a ton of them from this broken down ship. And it seems, at the moment, like it's pretty much an infinite supply. Um, it's, of course, it's how many you can actually take um, without your oxygen running out, basically. But the oxygen is actually running out really slowly, which is awesome. So I tell you what, I'm just going to grab a ton of planks. And I do also think we need some sticks as well. And we'll try and extend our raft just so it's a little bit bigger and we've got some space. Okay, I'm happy. I'm happy. This is going well. Oh. <laughs> I harvested all the ship. No. Oh, so much for it being an influence supply. Oh. I've harvested an entire ship. Oh, God. Okay, my oxygen is running really low. Oh, go, 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 go. And quick, 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 quick. Woo. Okay, that was close. Uh, good news is we got a good amount of uh, bits and pieces. So that's pretty awesome. So I, I tell you what, let's go. Let's put our sticks in here. Let's put our thingamajigs in here. Oh, we can only make two? Really? I would have expected more than that. What did we run out? Oh, we only, we, it's because we ran out of sticks. Right, okay. Well, that's not too much of a big deal. Um, so we've got our inventory here. Let's go and stick that one in there. Let's go and stick this one in here. Uh, and then we, if we swap to our building hammer... We can now choose these, and we can attach. Boom! Oh, I should have rotated them. Actually, you know what? I'm going to go with a fancy design. No, I, I want to rotate them like this. I'm going to go all of the ones on the sides pointing that way, and I'm going to have one going down the middle, which will be pointing straight. Nice! So I'll tell you what we'll do. Just before we end this episode, I'm going to go back down, and I'm going to try and harvest some more stuff. The one thing that I'm slightly concerned about is I don't actually know how to get water yet. Um, and I'm guessing we need to make some kind of fire, but... How we do that, I'm unsure. We need rope. How do we make rope? Is there a way to make rope here? Drying rack. I'm guessing that's for food. Crafting box. Boy. Wooden ceiling. Yeah, there's no recipe for rope, so I feel like we need to get that workbench. Hmm. Should we prioritize a workbench? I think we should. You know what? Let's make a workbench. I think that's the only way that we're going to be able to get the extra recipes. Okie dokie, so here goes nothing. Uh, let's see what this workbench is all about. I'm hoping that it might be able to have some kind of way to get water. Um, so what we need to do is we need to go in here. Uh, we need to use our items to plant sticks, metal scraps. What am I missing? Metal scraps. Oh, no, no. Here we go. I forgot to load them in. <laughs> there we go. Boo, workbench, craft. Okay. So that must be good, right? I'm hoping so. All right, let's stick that in our inventory, and let's go over to our little <laughs> makeshift raft. Basically, we're gonna have to rebuild the mega raft that we had in in raft. There's a lot of there's a lot of use of the word raft going on here. I, I'm sure you realise, but oh my goodness me, what is this? Oh, look at that. Okay, that looks really nice. So, what does this give us? Oh yeah! <laughs> look, we've got a barbecue bucket. Uh, which we can cook with. We've got a water distillery, which is actually quite cheap. Chests, beds, stand... Oh, fancy lanterns are back. Fancy lanterns are back, lads. Standing torches. We've got wooden doors, windows, stairs, dock, and a forge. Hey, now we'll be... We'll soon to be cooking on gas, lads. I am happy with our efforts today. You know what? This game is really good. So, uh, yeah, if you guys would like to continue seeing some more... Uh, Bermuda on the tri- uh, Bermuda on the triangle. <laughs> Bermuda on the channel. Then please remember to poke me in that like button. Let me know. And uh, yeah, if you're not here, subscribe. Go for it. Because we do Bermuda. Done fun. But until next time, thank you once again for watching. It's been such a pleasure. As always, thanks. Run up.